Welcome to Mrs. Jamo's Joyful Reading Corner. Let's turn on our imaginations as we read Robin Hill School Earth Day, written by Margaret McNamara, illustrated by Mike Gordon. Earth Day was coming. The banners in Mrs. Connor's classroom read, Save the Earth, but Emma did not know how. The other first graders had lots of ideas. I will rescue the polar bears, said Egan. I will plant a forest, said Katie. I will save the dolphins, said Michael. Those are big ideas, said Mrs. Connor. What other ideas can you think of? When Emma went home, she was sad. I cannot save the earth, Emma said to her dad. I do not have any big ideas. We can start small, said her dad. Small is no good, said Emma. Small is fine, said her dad. All that week, Emma and her dad did small things to help the earth. They shopped at the farmer's market. Emma brushed her teeth without running the water. Her dad turned off the TV. They went for walks and picked up trash along the way. They sorted cans and bottles. They used their bikes instead of the car. On Earth Day, Egan drew a picture of polar bears. Katie talked about forests. Michael made dolphin noises. Emma thought about all the things she did with her dad. Then she made her list. Her list was not long. From then on, Mrs. Connor's class slowed down. They recycled, and they only used what they needed to. Emma's small ideas are pretty big, said Mrs. Connor. The earth is safe in your hands. The end. Thanks for listening, and happy Earth Day!